Good morning. Welcome to the Pastor's Corner today. We're looking at Proverbs chapter 10, verses 8 through 10. Hear these words from the Lord. The wise of heart will receive commands, but a babbling fool will be ruined. He who walks in integrity walks securely, but he who perverts his way will be found out. He who winks the eye causes trouble, and a ruined, a babbling fool will be ruined. Proverbs 10, 8 through 10. Uh, we're looking at this, and uh, the scripture says a wise heart will receive in commands, receive instruction. Somebody who's wise will be able to keep his mouth shut and learn and grow um, when, when it's time to learn and grow. Um, and not only that, a wise of heart will walk in integrity. He will say what he means and means what he says. He will uh, be consistent in, in public and in private. Uh, he will be able to walk securely because all of his business deals and all of the things he does is above board and is right and good. But the scripture says uh, the babbling fool will be ruined. Um, he who perverts his way will be found out. Uh, and then he repeats the phrase uh, about he who winks with the eyes causes trouble and a babbling fool will be ruined. It's, it's uh, those who are talking all the time. And sometimes a babbling fool just talks because they're nervous and they're just talking, 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 talking. And, they, and you can't get in a word edgewise with a person who's a babbling fool. They all the, all they do is talk. They like to hear their own voice. They like to hear their own wisdom. They they just talk and talk and talk. And and when you're in a conversation, you realize you're not in a conversation. You're in a monologue. And the scripture says that person will come to ruin. What what that person will find out is they will have little friends. They will have little people who will stand in for the gap for them because all the all they are is about themselves. Um, and he who perverts his ways, who he cuts corners and cheats, uh, I'm going to be found out. My mom always said, be sure your sins will find you out. And guess what? She's right. Uh, you might think you're hiding them from your parents. You might think that you're hiding them from your spouse. You might think you're getting away with it. But the scripture says, he who perverts his ways will be found out at some point in time. And if not in this life, definitely when the day of judgment comes uh, Jesus will, will will judge us for all the things that we said. The scripture says, even this, every word that comes out of our mouth, the Lord will judge. And then he says, he who winks with his eyes causes trouble. You know, the, the wink of letting other people know that you're pulling one over on somebody, which makes that person that you're winking and, and think not trust you. And, and in the end, your relationship will be broken. And a babbling fool, it says, will come to a ruin. And so when we are doing all the talking, uh, may the Holy Spirit check us and saying, are, are we the one that's talking, 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 talking? And then all of a sudden, uh, ruin comes upon us because we have not been listening to what people are saying around us. Well, let's pray. Heavenly Father, I pray that you'd give us a wise heart, that we'd be able to receive instruction from others and from you. Lord, I pray that we'd be men and women of integrity so that we can walk securely, that we don't have to fear. Lord, I pray that you would forgive us when we pervert our ways or forgive us when we, we talk too much and we are talking and talking and talking because we're nervous, because um, we are unsettled. And I pray that you would help us to be people of integrity. Help us not to be babbling fools, but be people of a wise heart. Lord, may we follow you today and may you fill us with your spirit so that we may walk in integrity. In Christ's name, amen. You have a beautiful day and may the Lord bless you today.